Right, they're, they're two different countries, mate. They're two actual different countries. That's like me saying, right, someone from fucking Texas sounds hey, like someone hello. from California. Just, hey, how you doing there, preacher? Shit, isn't it? Yeah, I'm doing pretty now. good. I gotta talk to these green people real quick. We're all quick. good now. We're all clear. Green people, okay. Yeah, I'll call you right back. Yeah, give me a call. All right. All right, take care. All right. I mean, hey, dog. I'm just putting in my input. You feel me? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, from now on, if we on gang block, we just go ahead. We ask you what's good. Hey, dog, you mind if I take this vehicle? We move on. We get the fuck. We get the step in real quick. You feel me? Yeah, all I right. mean, listen, because there's sometimes when it's, there might be cars down here. We need you all to tow. Other times it might be all of our cars. And if they're all on the sidewalk or whatever, we're just showing them off. It doesn't mean that, you know, we're fucking <laughs> illegally parked. This is our home. This is our block, you know? Like the sidewalk, technically, the government states it's theirs, but we say to the government, fuck them, come grab it. Yeah, we we provide more to the streets around here than we right. right now. Like, if people are over here are still in packages, you know, they're gonna have to answer to us type shit. I, I'm just out here, man. I ain't trying to get oh, yeah, no my shot grandma or needs her fucking box. What the hell is this guy talking on behalf of me right now? At first. I get it, I get it. Listen, that's all we ask is that if y'all motherfuckers are down here, y'all just talk to one of us. And if we ain't around, I probably just wouldn't tow it. So who who speaks on y'all's behalf? Because I heard three separate things earlier. A couple of I mean, us do. Yeah, I mean, we all do. All right, so like, what's what's kind of the lowdown? So what happened earlier exactly? I don't know. You tell me. Well, it looked like you had a vehicle that was just up uh, sitting on top of a bunch of equipment. It was towed, and uh, one of y'all gentlemen pulled out a weapon, threatening to murder people. Was it a threat a, a, or an indirect threat? Well, I don't know. You tell me. Well, did you feel threatened, or did other people feel threatened? Well, if you pull out a gun and you're stating you're going to start blasting, then of course it's going to sound like a threat. I don't think anybody said that. Well, I mean, no, reg I regardless. Did. Regardless, whether maybe that's what you do on the on the daily, that's perfectly fine. But like, so a, what? I, what? what I it, how do you? Question for you. Did any of the guns get point pointed directly at you? I know. Listen, I'm not worried about that. Or uh, the, my concern, the only thing I want to know is what is it that you want exactly? Well, you said something that piqued our interest. Right. Well, no, I'm talking about the toes. Gonna, yeah, we're not going to talk about that. We're not the talking toes. About the yeah. toes all we just want, is, a, all we want simple... is people to come down here with respect yeah just okay. talking you know come you're talk. gonna have to explain Don't that just... i'm from montana what do you mean by respect i think i spoke to you very respectfully you know you see somebody them. outside you know a car could be theirs you know you pull up hello is that your car nah i'm gonna tow it yada 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 yo the other thing too is if you lived in Montana, motherfucker, you I bet your ass you park your shit anywhere in your driveway. You probably got like a fucking fifteen acre fucking yard, right? Park what the shit fuck? Hey, we ain't all like that in Montana. I, that's very disrespectful. <laughs> oh my bad, my apologies. Yeah. Now here are my two translators. They're gonna help me here. Gentlemen, introduce yourselves. Hello. Listen, the. I don't think you need <laughs> translators, bro. This guy with the checkered jacket or whatever the fuck pattern that shit is, he's probably your best translator. I'm not even going to lie. What, this guy over here? Yeah, because he came down what's here. What's up, Jack? He's, he's Scottish. No, so, no, yeah, what's up, lads? Yeah. No. Hey, I'm Ben. Nice to meet you, lads. <laughs> no, no. Now, I couldn't Scottish understand to you, so these two are going to help me understand. <laughs> Basically, what they want is they would like you to ask politely if that's their vehicle before. I mean, it doesn't it. have to be politely, just you know, <laughs> just Yo, come what's check. Up? Your whip? No, all right, I'm gonna tow this shit then. We'll be like, all right. All right, so you want us to go up and down this entire road asking if anyone owns the vehicle? I mean, if you see yeah, them if, buy it and it could right. possibly be their car, then ask. All right, nobody's around, just tell that bitch. So the individual that owned that vehicle is nowhere to be seen until well, hang on, hang ran on. They said the you said before you said before that if no one's around we shouldn't tow it. But now you're saying if no one's around tow it. I mean shit, if we're not around, just fucking tow bitch. If it's parked incorrectly. I mean it's your okay, job, the right? Other, the other thing too would be like listen, you see like this whole side of the block right here where we've been standing where this whole cluster fuck occurred? 
if there's cars parked on the sidewalk right here or half-assed in the driveway or whatever on the grass it's probably our vehicles i like i, I don't know it, it's yeah, the thing the to me is, is i just don't understand where like uh you've got to have common sense when you're doing it i mean not you a know? lot of not a lot of people understand how it's supposed to be in like hoods and shit dog i'm gonna be real with you so that's why i came down and actually discussed it in fact i should go on the radio and tell them hey yo tell homies this is what's going on you know rather than you know hey look it's also it, it, and this road probably the same, ain't gonna be the this, first yeah. and it ain't gonna be the last that's for you're having the, the same issue with the taxi drivers bro you're just your bought your tow drivers are Pulling out, ta uh, pulling taxis up when they're okay. Fucking, oh, okay. Up. I don't think right. any of us. That's a different, look, that's a different here's subject. the thing, yeah, right? I mean, it's just ain't nobody gonna be able to speak down. to all uh, for on behalf of all the taxi drivers or the tow drivers. Yeah, I mean, the do. goddamn person that was speaking on behalf of the tow drivers earlier today, that dumbass was towing around an airplane trying to drop it off at the tow lot. So, you're speaking to me right now. I'm the one yeah, that I'm had the situation. Weird. I don't really care what anyone else's opinion is with, the, uh, you know, it, the other tow driver's opinions are. No disrespect to you guys, but I hope you understand what I'm saying. If there's an issue with some individuals, you should probably speak to them. Right. I'm not worried about the whole tow community as a whole. It's just, you know, for your own sake. Yeah. Why so, you guys all do the same? So what I'm just, I'm just curious. Did you not see any of us on this, on this block when you hooked up that, that truck? There was two individuals way along the way, yes. However, at the same time, this vehicle was sitting on top of a bunch of shit. Now, one would presume with common sense that some dumbass left it there, all right, that probably doesn't live here if they're kind of trashing up their own neighborhood. Well, that's the direct opposite. The dumbass does live down here. Yep, and I he understand. Like yeah, but... Well, I understand now we know. how you could be confused. <laughs> All right. So you want, so just lay it down. What What is it that you'd like to see? You want, for, uh, if y'all are around, you want us to ask if it's someone's vehicle and then move it? Well, if it's, yeah, yeah. Pretty much. we just want, you know, we're humans. Right. We like to be That's easy enough. To. You know, we want to be treated like human beings also. But yeah, just because but, we the hood don't yep, mean like yep, we yeah, treat yep, like yep, shit, yep. huh? Hey you man, this ain't no hood. This. Well, this is the hood, bro. Ah oh, man, this is a city. This is a wee town that's on the outskirts, mate. It's a nice right, place, say, man. Say, I, like, I would say like the last like four words again. Ah, uh, it's like a new school of the town, mate. And, uh, you know, I would buy a house here. It's nice and lovely. You get uh, me? What? What? What did he? Say? I don't see. This is I did, I did, I this is what it sounded to me when yeah. I was talking to the other gentleman. To be honest, I don't. I don't understand what it's the outskirts or That's the other person that was screaming earlier. It's the That's outskirts. Right. This is the I'll, south I'll, side. I'll, I'll, I'll dumb it down. He's trying to flatter us. Okay, yeah. I was about to say. I think you need a translator for your translator, bro. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, he doesn't need no translator for me. You guys understand exactly what I'm saying. Okay, I didn't get Ninety percent of it. Yeah. I understand yeah. it, but it has a, a heavy accent. The the best, the best way I could possibly explain it is that <laughs> if you're on this side of Forum, right, and there's cars on this side of the road, we'll just keep it as simple as possible. Don't tow that shit, right? Or ask one of us first if it's our car or not. That's the easiest way to go about it. If there's nobody down here, and we got 10 cars parked right here in this motherfucker on this side of the road, don't touch it. If you're on that half of Forum, and there's fucking bullshit going on down there, fuck it, tow that shit. But we'd still prefer that you come down here before you tow it. All right. So this side of farm is it? Is it? Does it end like on that road over there? Or is it this whole wraparound? The whole, the whole the wraparound. wraparound. All right. And just this road. Guys, so it starts over here you, and ends over there. Form. Yeah. So you have, you have to remember, we're the ones that protect this fucking street. We protect that more than probably more than the actual PD do. Like if you come down here trying to tow a vehicle guys... and we're in a and we're in a fucking shootout because some fucking idiot is trying to fucking. Uh, rob someone's house or something like that. We're the ones that protect it. Well, if you guys are about to get kidnapped right in front of me, you know, you probably won't let it slide unless you're out here towing our cars. Ah, oh, oh, basically, well. you guys are in the neighborhood watch, then I. All right. That's what I said earlier. I said you were like the HOA. Yeah, we didn't understand what the fuck that meant. Homeowners Association. Yeah, they don't. They don't yeah, that's work like, with that this sounds over like, here. Yeah, yeah. You, you, you like charge people to live shit. down here. You make sure everything's like how it should be. You got a set of rules. That's 
That's yeah, some violent only, houses type shit. The only thing is, like, if we don't get our way in the HOA, quote unquote, we solve it with violence. That's pretty much it. We just get our way. All right. All right. Well, simple enough then. Simple enough, homie. <coughs> All right. Trying well, one of y'all sure give me good. a call later if you want to talk about the other thing. Well, well also, I am running right for mayor. Talk, yeah, how about we talk about it? Like, now. you know, I'm not throwing it out there. Bar. Like, oh yeah, we yeah, can sidebar. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. Well, All right, as long as they make some money, sell, I'll catch bro. you guys in a bit. Yeah, yeah. We're, we're uh, uh, as long as this is the thing. As long as they come down here, they at least look for us and see, and speak like. You have to remember, us, most of us haven't gone to school. Most of us haven't fucking done that. We've all been taught by our fucking families. So I dropped out when I was 13. Yeah. Wait, so did I. I 14, 14 years old. old. Damn straight. I don't think you really need an education. Like, officially. I think it's kind of a waste of money, to be honest. I mean, it's I, better I, to be I think, street I think smart. I'm doing pretty well for myself. Look, look I'm at the chain smart. I'm on Yep. I right. mean, education's what dropped nice the chain. goddamn nukes on this place. Right. Yeah, I'll make a radio announcement saying, "Hey, if you want form on the like this side of form, just ask before you tow cars. <laughs> if you're on the other side of form, then it's free reign, but still ask." Dude, I I love how like yeah. unaware right, cool. of All like this. street and shit wait, you leave, Jack is. What's your name, Mister Head of the Tow Association or whatever? Oh, it's Jacuzzi. You can call me. Uzi. Uzi. Yeah, oh, Jacuzzi. What? You go by Jacuzzi or Uzi? Is it, yeah, I was, gonna, I was gonna say that sounds like a, I'm saying easy nickname. I mean, it's up to you, really. I go by Jock, Sully, Uzi, Kuzi. Sully? They That's my last Sully. name. It's Sullivan, but they not me. Start calling you Sully. Uzi, bro. Jacuzzi That's, Sullivan. Yeah, that's the name. Uh, so I mean, yeah, I, I might call I, you Jock. Might end up being Jock. Hey man, it's all good. That being said, I'm gonna go do my thing. I bet. I'll right. catch you on the flip side. Hey, you mind you mind taking him with you? Cause I gotta talk to these individuals and he's probably gonna need a ride. Yeah, I'm gonna need a ride. 